coming out tonight. Uh, appreciate it. It's a, it's a fantastic day for liberty, as it always is. Uh, we're also living in very dangerous times, as we all know, we all see. So thank you for coming out and seeing our candidates. I want to talk to you a moment about LP Nova and what we do. We are the uh, regional affiliate of the Libertarian Party up here in Northern Virginia, with Fairfax County, Arlington City, Alexandria, and, and uh, Falls Church. Um, we are here to build the party uh, and provide grassroots support for our candidates. And a testament to that is that we've got four candidates sitting up here tonight uh, throughout Northern Virginia representing all of our area, uh, and we can't be any more proud of them. Of them. And LP Nova is growing, and we want more members, more people to come and, and be a part of our board. Uh, if you have any interest in, in serving in any board positions or getting more active with the Libertarian Party of Northern Virginia, please come see me at the end of this, uh, the evening, and I will be happy to get you signed up and get, re get you ready to go. And, um, and again, thank you so much for coming out. Uh, enjoy the speakers tonight. I would feel terrible if I didn't introduce to all of you this evening two noteworthy Libertarians who are in the audience tonight. First, I would like to introduce uh, the Libertarian candidate for mayor of the District of Columbia, Bruce Majors. Bruce also serves as our videographer. Thank you, Bruce. <laughs> and the second, and we're particularly happy to have here, to be able to introduce someone who say, we have a libertarian who won an election this year, and his name is Tyler Brown. He's a council member for the town of Oxford. Thank you for showing up. Um, so what we're going to do tonight we want to give all of you a chance to meet your candidates, meet your Libertarian candidates. And most importantly, we want to make this very interactive. We want this to be an open uh, discussion so you can really get to know the candidates and what's important to them and uh, where they stand on the issues that are important to you. So we're going to have some brief introductions where the candidates can uh, say some opening remarks. And then we'll get the, we'll get the uh, ground running with the Q&A. Um, so I'll begin with our esteemed uh, candidate for U.S. Senate. We all know him. He was a candidate for governor last year, Rob Sarvis. Thank you all. Uh, you, you might have seen my campaign last year for governor. Uh, it, was, it was a statewide campaign that uh, got a lot of attention and I think brought a lot of people more recognition about what libertarians stand for. And I think uh, e even if we didn't get to 10% or even uh, uh, winning the election, was at the very least we got people thinking about how far we've gotten away from the idea that people should be free, uh, both at the state and federal level. And one of the reasons why I wanted to run again this year is that the federal government is, uh, just, like, just like the state government, has gotten away from those principles of freedom. And it's our time as libertarians to put forward a message that freedom actually works 